you are battling with these issues that I'll be mentioning, then this video is for you. If you're having sex in the dream, you are eating in the dream. This brings set back to our life. It is what the tool that the enemy used to delay our blessing and to render us useless. So if you want to know how to get rid of it, it's just natural ingredients at home. Keep watching and don't skip any parts of this video. Each and every part of them are very, very vital and useful. I feel nauseous, believe me. Hello, Heidi and amazing people. Welcome back to our channel. Hope you all are doing great. Hope you all are healthy. So if it's your first time of stopping by, you're beautiful and you are highly welcome. Don't forget to like, subscribe and share before going and for my return. It's that case coming back. God bless you for always coming back to support me, okay? So guys, if you're having sex in the dream and you're having bad dreams, these are tools that the enemy will use to bring you down, destroy you, and render you hopeless. But this recipe works like magic. And what you need are natural, which I'll be mentioning to you in a jiffy. But before I start with, please enable to know your uh, your elements because your elements matters a lot in life. Your elements will help you to know where your power lies and your elements will help you in life. Okay? So you know what to avoid and to make your uh, you know, life, spiritual life, to be, you know, uplifted. Okay? So what you'll be needing is fertility leaf. Ukiri leaf is what we call it in my own um, dialect. Yoruba people call it Iwa Akoko. So you can get it in a, in lo in a uh, spiritual shop, those people that used to say harbors things, you can get it there and you are good to go. Now, you need the fresh one. 21 pieces is what you need. And what you're going to do with these 21 pieces is very easy. In the night when you want to sleep, you put that 21 pieces of that leaf under your pillow and pray with it and put it there and sleep. In the morning, when you wake up in the morning, you bring it out and you squeeze out the liquid of it into a container. Square after you squeeze out this um the liquid of it, you get a black soup, you get sniff, sniff that otaba that they uh, all these uh, grandpas and grannies used to put in their nose and they will hats hats <laughs> that is uh, the sniff otaba that is what we call it. You get it and you add it in in black soap and you pound it with that sharp that you remove from that fertility leaf. You pound it all together and then. You use a local sponge and that liquid to bait. You'll be using that fertility leaf, add it on water, then you use this black soap and local sponge. Please don't look, use your own normal sponge. Use that your local sponge and you have to be baiting with it from your head to your toe. As you're baiting, you're praying and asking God every form of attack. Those that want to render me useless. If you have cobweb issue, you can as well use it. Okay, and after doing this, you see that, hmm. You will start experiencing turnaround and things begin to be very, very better for you. Okay, so after using it, then you go ahead and sleep. Don't dry your body and don't wear slippers when you're taking this bath and don't dry your body. These two things, please avoid avoid sex when, when taking this bath. Avoid sex so that it will be effective on you. You have to abstain for sex. If you are a woman, please don't do it on your menstruation. Just make sure that after menstruation, after menstruating, you use this salt to cleanse yourself for like three days before you perform this recipe so that it will work for you. Because some certain people are saying, I do this, it doesn't work for you. Because you are filled with negativity, you need to bait it away before you start using any spiritual item before it will work for you. Alright, so if you love the video and you want to see more, don't forget to like, subscribe and share before going, okay?